I gotta say, I'm not very easily impressed, but I'm very impressed with this product so far. I'm definitely gonna be doing some more research into this, but I mean, it's really small and lightweight, similar to the GoPro. It's a little bit thicker, if you look at it from front to back, it's a little bit thicker than the, than the GoPro, but not so mu much more than the GoPro. And all these accessories to come with it, and I automatically, you know, one of the first things I wonder is like, what's the quality? You know, oh, they gave all these accessories, but they're probably gonna be garbage, right? That's what I'm thinking. But look at this, you see that? That's not plastic, man. That's not plastic, they've got metal in there, and where there is plastic, it's a, it's, it looks like it's a pretty solid grade, man. I don't think I'm going to be able to break this very easily. I mean, look at this. Yeah, this this looks solid, man. This is not cheap, flimsy plastic. It's very, it's very thick. I don't know about this piece. This might be the weakest piece here, but overall, this looks like pretty good quality stuff, man. This is a standardized mounting, just like on a drift, so this is awesome. They're not locking you into their stuff because you can buy you can buy accessories to mount this on from other companies because it's using a standard... Whoa. Don't worry about it. This is, yeah. <laughs> and it's durable. <laughs> it's actually got an actual, an actual legitimate on and off switch. Record button. And these buttons are like nice clicky button. They're not mushy like on the GoPro. So this is pretty awesome. I'll do the research for you guys, but it looks like this is a really good product here. So um, we shall see. And then it's coming with a charger and all this kind of stuff. Like, wow. With the video screen, you can use it for a couple of different functions. The primary function, of course, is to frame your shot where you're going to be shooting. Okay. Then the uh, secondary things are to access the menu. Okay. This is the other reason why our camera is easier, because it's easy to get to the menu, it's easy to go through the menu, it's easy to change stuff. For instance, if you want to change video resolution, you scroll for five hours of battery time. So on the surface, this camera looks pretty awesome. It's very small. It's got five hours of battery life. It's got the quarter 20 mounts. So you can put it right on a tripod. I know people like uh, SpacePod are going to enjoy this for moto vlogging because action cameras should really be as small as possible. So I'm not pulling my wallet out just yet. I'm just now discovering this camera, so I'm checking it out. It does look like a good contender. But if you want to learn more about this, go ahead and click on this link to check it out on my car and bike channel, Your Fast Life, and subscribe for future updates. <laughs> Watching Carlisle's Picks here in Las Vegas. Don't forget to subscribe.